Welcome back to the tutorial. Let's go ahead and end the turn. See where that puts us. Objective complete. So we found it a colony that gets us food. Um. And I guess. Oh, that provides energy. So, Replicator Factory, followed by Rectome, and we'll wait. And you have no sectors to exploit. So, yeah, okay, that's cool. So, if we're not doing anything, it automatically switches to this. Um, do we want an owl or a pug? Let's produce a pug. And... It, all right, so this one has an upkeep of four. This one has no upkeep, so let's go ahead and produce this. Okay. Interesting. So there's a food is global. Hmm. Okay, so does that mean on this one? Oops, wrong one. Here. We go to this, uh, and immediately take it off auto. Clear, clear, clear. Two, three, four. All right, so there's no surplus, apparently. So we'll leave that there. Um, and I guess we want to head to here. Are you healed up? If I select you, you're halfway healed. You in there. And... You're only five units. But that's okay. You can head in... This direction, I guess. Um... What's our scout unit? Is the owl our scout? Four units. Laser repeater, targeting film only just scout. So let's go ahead and produce one of these as well. Actually, can you build the owl? If we go into Terran? Oh, there we go. Yes. Oh, that's gonna take forever. All right, uh, orders required. Way to turn, you're healing up. Hobton can, an yeah, so like, if we look here, production energy, food science. Food energy science, that's cool. I can't do that one. All right, so we can either get this one or this one. And I'm leaning towards this one because of the mountain. But we need a unit there. Let's bump this up to the top. Yep. Oh, you can annex your first sector. Well, I think we're going to want this sector because of this. So we're working on that. Right click, right click. There we go. All right, let's end the turn. Sun's out. No, oh, that was the end of the turn. All right, are you healed? That will be good enough. Let's get them both in. 
Wait a turn. You wait a turn. End the turn. Done. All right. All right, look at that. Uh, so let's move you here. Wave in two seconds. Gravitonic wave? What? What the hell was that? The gravitonic wave passed through the system, origin unknown. Well, it looks like we're all still holding on to our atoms. Status report. Preliminary readings indicate that the void anomaly absorbed most of the gravitonic force keeping the planet relatively unaffected. For further analysis, I will need to connect to the Void Tech facility it contains advanced sensors that are due to the Void Anomaly. Alright, move in and get you hooked up to the facility ASAP. There are signs of the battle all over the structure. Lieutenant Yang, is the facility still operational? The damage you see in the structure is all superficial. All the heavy fighting occurred on the outskirts. Ava, can you access the facility and use its sensors to see what's happening with the Void Anomaly? This facility is a cryptic command. Establishing connection will require the Void... Yeah, that's what I figured. Now we've got to annex it. Okay. Land's marks are remnants of powerful Star Union structures. There are three kinds of landmarks. Bronze, silver, and gold with increasing economic value. Right. Landmarks have an inherent exploitation with gold and silver landmarks automatically counting as a level 5 sector. Landmarks unlock special doctrines and colony structures when they are annexed. Gold and silver landmarks first need to be entered. Defeat the guard within and only a single army can enter a structure. Okay. Right, well, annex and that will take a turn. And now we have a scout. Hi, Scout! To here! And you're going to Hobton. Alright, you're building a pug. And I guess... It wouldn't hurt going to science to go ahead and pick that up. So let's go ahead and close that. We now have smart defense modules. If properly targeted, a bullet will hit its mark at a speed impossible for humans to dodge. To increase human evasion, one needs smart defenses. Want to dodge a bullet? Obtain a detector capable of triggering ballistic shields preemptively. All right. I guess... Void Blades. Ooh. Oh, so are these guys melee? Void Blades Quantum Pulse Biological Light Unit Infantry. That's cool. For a drone development. That's cool. Bunker Buster. Emergency Recon. Right, well, we're working on that. We'll let that sit. Um, back to this colony. and production. Okay, and food development one. Food is a governing tool. Just as fuel is essential to power a machine, food is the ruling principle of happy, strong, and productive colonists. Tony oh. Rubio Strong, Manpower and Machine Motivational Consulting. Okay. So does that mean we go into here. Sorry. Sector. We can either build. Okay. Can you build both? Advanced bioengineering can create superfoods that have a beneficial effect on colony. Colonist biology and the growth rate of the colony need less food as upkeep. So because it's level one, no, it's one or the other.
but we can either make them grow faster and reduce food upkeep. Interesting. So 50% food need to gain it. Yeah, but if you run out of space, like, that's my question. If I run out of colonists, right, we'll say, what happened? Does that make sense? Although we have a max population of 19. Uh, but we're not really sharing. Let's try the oh, bioengineered food. And that will take two turns. All right. Now uh, we're exploiting that. What is required? Um, we're still working on that. So you can wait a turn. Where's your required? Oh, that's interesting. Um. Alright, it seems to loop around. We've got mountains in the way. Uh, I guess you can go into here. Go ahead and end the turn. Establishing database. Connect. Hey, the Wicked Sinner. Yeah, welcome to uh, the stream. Connection to Void Tech Facility Database Established. Running analysis of Void Anomaly. Or, what are your findings? Void Anomaly has started to expand. Yeah, it looks like it always loops around. That's what I was curious about. Uh, it's started to expand exponentially. There is a 99.07% chance the plant will be consumed by the anomaly within the next three cycles. We should leave. Back up all data from Sydney and get everyone evacuated. There is no time to waste. Backup status complete. Planetary set for calculated. Due to void disturbance, there's a 33% chance of catastrophic failure during gravity while escape. Safety margins need to be over before course can be locked in. The hell with the safety margins. There's a 100% chance we'll die if we stay. Lock in the escape vectors. Lock and get us out of this hellhole. Oh, and that was it. Done. We finished the tutorial. I believe that is three videos at roughly 20 to 30 minutes apiece. That was interesting. Um, oh, and they give you a little... A turn 10, you can look at that sort of thing. That wasn't too bad. It's an hour and a half for a map, though. So, you know. A little long. Um, but that's interesting. I like the concept. We'll continue the campaign. I'm going to go ahead and end this recording. Thank you very much for watching. As always, feel free to like, subscribe, or comment if you're on YouTube. Or come on over and check me live every Wednesday through Saturday, starting out with roughly 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on Twitch. Thank you very much. Have a nice day.